We left Benalmatis about half an hour ago. And the rest, that's uh, five minutes ago. Um, but this morning the, we, we're going around the island because we're going up to Peggy and um, the wind seems to be following us round on the nose but uh, it's quite a, quite a swell coming in. We've got a bit of fetch from the, from the island. And it's so, raining. And it's raining, yep. So we're on the engine. Managed to get the Genoa out and we've got somewhere around 5.7 knots um, speed over ground so we're doing doing quite well with just the Genoa out and um, we've only got 10-12 knots of wind so yeah. So what happened yesterday? Yesterday was an interesting day. We left the Normatus um, quite early in the morning actually and um, we did sail for quite a sort of period of time. Three quarters of an hour, yes. get a grip. Yeah, there was there was wind, it was sort of coming and going. But, uh, came into Peddy sort of late morning and once we'd anchored and we were sure that the anchor was set, we set off into Simi Town to check in, which was interesting. <laughs> Went to the port police, um, they stamped us in, uh, which was great, so we got a passport stamped and sent us round to the um, port authority. When we got to the port authority, he told us that um, we needed to go to customs first. The problem with that was, the customs weren't there. So we waited around in Simi for a few hours until about just after five and a, a lady turned up and um, we immediately accosted her. And she told us that there was nobody there until Monday morning, about nine o'clock. So we actually couldn't do our transit log for Greece, and that will be done on Monday now. But the Port Authority told us that we were okay to stay here. We were signed in on passports, and we could stay as long as we wanted. We just needed to go to customs and get the transit log as soon as we could. This is the Bay of Peddy on the island of Simi and we came up here yesterday as Kevin explained and it's really pretty and the only trouble with this bay is the holding is pretty poor and if you've got strong winds coming it's a little bit dodgy. We have actually got strong winds coming on Tuesday and today is Sunday so tomorrow is the day we need to go back to the customs office and do our paperwork hopefully and then we need to head off back down to Penomatus, which is the kind of boat hole for storms and things down here. And it's on the southern side of this island. It only takes about two and a half hours, something like that, to get there. And hopefully, if we've got a bit of wind, we'll be able to sail. We're just leaving Peddy. We're all checked in. Been to the customs this morning. It only took three days. Yeah, the customs weren't there yesterday or Saturday, so... It wasn't their fault. But um, we checked in and then checked out immediately because we're, we're leaving on Wednesday but there's a storm coming in tomorrow and um, they said that we had 24 hours to leave after we've actually signed out but then they gave us an extension and an extra day so um, that's okay. Yeah. So we're just leaving Peddy now, um, decent anchorage but the wind does swirl around a lot. Absolutely, yeah. So I mean, yeah. that was another two years. I don't think we'll be doing much sailing today. Absolutely flat calm, it's beautiful. 
So we're coming down the east coast of Simi, down towards the bottom bay, which is Penomatus, which is where we were the other day. Expecting some big winds tomorrow, so we thought we'd tuck in here for at least 24 hours, see what the winds do, and then um, head off after that. Well, good morning. It's about the 6th of March, I think, and we are leaving Panomatus, sorry for this week, leaving Panomatus for the um, second time. Only this time we're heading across to the island of Tilos, we think. Wind, well, last night we had quite a storm, so with thunder and lightning all night, quite a lot of rain, gusting winds, but not too bad. And the sea's obviously a bit swelly this morning in relation to that. But we thought we'd head off because there's some wind today. We have put two reefs in the main and we've put, well, a couple of reefs in the Genoa as well. Just thought we'd take it nice and gently and see how we go. Well, this is a bit more like we expected. We've got about 18 to 20 knots of wind. And we're flying along now, we're doing 6.9 knots. I think it's supposed to come off here in the afternoon, but... Yeah, it's difficult to say. Yeah, and we've got a fishing line out. That's never a good thing. over another six miles to go. Unfortunately we are kind of heading in the wrong direction again. So we'll have to tack as we get closer to the island but that's uh, oh, only a short tack and we should be into the uh, into the Bay of Nevada. I don't know what time it is but we're doing seven knots at the moment. We should be in for just about over an hour I would think. How was the sea state? Yeah better. Yeah lots of big waves. A bit longer now. Yeah, so we're still reefed down. We've got two reefs in the main and we've got probably one reef in the Genoa. Um, and we're still doing between seven and eight knots at times, so yeah, we should be there within an hour. Well, we've come ashore on the island of Tilos in Lavadi, taking the rubbish, the usual story. Thought we'd come for some fresh air and a bit of a walk. And there's some music going on over there somewhere. Let's see if we can find out what it is. Well, this is a party going on. Yeah. So we're all checked into Tillos. Yeah, paperwork all done. Checked everything, transit log, insurance, uh, crew list, usual stuff really. Yeah, all done. And we did get some information about the party. It's um, National Day. Yeah, when they broke free some, of Turkey. Yeah, something to do with breaking free of Turkey, so... Another feeling? <laughs> yeah. 
What have you found? It's rotten. The old tree. Left to us about, what, an hour ago? Half an hour ago, maybe? And um, it was gusting through the, through the anchorage, but when we sort of left initially, it, it dropped off to nothing, and now it's picked up again. And we've got what? Um, between 18 and 23 gusts. So Levadia Anchorage is renowned for being a little bit difficult to, to keep the anchor in. Uh, the wind swirls around in sort of all different directions and it is very hard sand so you have to be a little bit careful. So we were a little bit aware that um, the, wind, the wind shift was going to be a bit of a problem but luckily we didn't have any wind overnight. Anyway, we're on our way to uh, Yali, which is a little quarry that's on an island between Nisiros, Nisiros and uh, Kos. And that'll be our stopover for tonight before we head to Kos tomorrow. The one that got a bit close. Uh, we did radio three or four times and got absolutely no response. So there isn't much more you can do. But uh, AIS told us we were going to miss him, so we were okay. But uh, he got a bit close. So the sea state's picked up a little bit, doesn't really show it very well here, but um, we're just coming into the lee of the island of uh, Nisiros, so we're hoping it's going to calm down a bit. Just heading past Nisiros on our port side, on our starboard side, we have Yali. After about 10 tacks. We are more or less there now, and uh, there is actually a cargo ship in, so we're going to go in the corner, on the right of the ship, so hopefully it'll be a little bit more sheltered. Any good sail? Yeah, very good. 